thank you so much. Salamat kuya. Thank you. Bye bye. This is the main entrance? Yes, thank you so much. Bye bye. Ooh, very good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we have a huge plane welcoming and starting our video with this great occasion. We are here in a mall of Asia, which is the biggest mall in Philippines. And uh, one of the things you have to know about Philippines is that Filipino people love shopping malls. Everywhere I have stayed, when I look at the maps, almost uh, every kilometer, every 500 meters, you can actually see another mall. And this is the biggest, and I came to explore. Hopefully they will allow us to film. That's our objective, to see what we can capture, what we can buy, what we can eat. I'm very hungry, so I'm looking forward to get some food first and later on have more energy to exploration. The biggest mall in Philippines, Mall of Asia, and the fifth biggest in the world. So, as you can imagine how huge it is. All right, let's go. This is the main entrance. We have a Filipino flag right there. There's a fountain in the beginning, and uh, there's some food section on the left side, but we're gonna see if they allow us to film and then we're gonna get some food as a first thing in the afternoon all right hello hi hello, sir. how are you hello. Hello? okay thank you hello how are you guys good good i'm safe thank you <laughs> all right this is the entrance the taxi driver told me this is the main entrance might not be but maybe main entrance for the taxi drop but this is the ceiling quite huge one two three floors we have a shake shack here on the left side and uh, I have a very specific wish for lunch today and I'm gonna ask the ladies where we can find it hi guys how are you <laughs> where I can find Jollibee uh, just left side. on the left side okay is the best food in Philippines <laughs> best fast food all right thank you <laughs> so another thing you have to know about philippine and Fili filipino people is the fact they love jollibee jollibee is the fast food chain here uh, something similar to kfc concept uh, they have fried uh, fried uh, chicken mostly but uh, filipino people love it they have a very emotional connection with the brand because uh, I think most of the Filipino people actually grew up with this brand. So probably family visits as, as they were kids. But right now it's also very famous. Even though there's such a huge competition with all the different big brands, like there's Cho King, there is a KFC next to Jollibee, and uh, McDonald's, um, and Popeye, and other brands, but still, People love Jollibee, so we're gonna go get it. Hi guys! Oh my God, so many people! Hi, <laughs> hi! You love Jollibee? Yeah, very much. Is the best food? Yeah, it's the best, best food. Best food in Philippines. Yeah. Okay, I go. I'm gonna test it. What's your favorite? What do you eat normally? Burger steak. Steak. Hi, guys. Burger steak. I know. Hi, hi. A spaghetti with chicken. It's good. Spaghetti yeah. with chicken. Okay, and what do you drink? Drink? Coca-Cola. Coca -Cola. Okay. Or Royal? Royal? Yeah, Fanta? So but what's your yeah. favorite? Mm, Coke. And Coke. Blue. Coke, spaghetti, and chicken. Yeah, like okay. I ordered that. Thank you, guys. I can order peach mango pie. Peach what? Peach mango pie. Peach mango pie. Bite. Pie. 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 Yeah. There's a pie peach here. Peach mango pie. Peach mango pie. I, I buy that too. Okay. Bye. Thank you. See you guys. Thank you, see you. Oh, that's, that's so full, so many people here. It's crazy. Hi, guys. There's a line there, so we're gonna go stay in the line, get some food, and then later on, if you find seats outside, we will do that. If not, uh, we're gonna sit inside. Line starts here, so kiosk line. I can order directly there? Yes, sir. I can order there. Thank you. It's 
So this is the menu option, guys. We have a burgers. We have the menu. We have the spaghetti. I'm gonna get, I think, spaghetti with chicken. That's what they said. It's free. Okay, here. Thank you. Hi guys, how are you? Como está cá? Okay, Lang. Nice. I come to try Jollibee, your favorite food. It's my name, Davud. Do you have phone? You have phone? It's Davud. D A V U D. I write a note. Okay. D A V U D. Oh no. D A V U D and A K H. Okay, you will find it. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. So See you. Bye bye. So, uh, can I please have a chicken with spaghetti? Yes. But not so big, small portion. Chicken and spaghetti. Okay, and uh, you have a. Huh? Drinks, uh, Coca Cola. And I will have a peach pie. Peach mango pie. One. Yes, please, here. Thank you. And I will pay with cards, please. Thank you. So we're gonna pay 189. This card, please. Thank you. Thank you. So spaghetti, chicken, and a pie, yeah? And a Coca Cola. Thank you. Thank you so much. I think she's gonna give me the receipt and then that's it. Salamat, thank you so much. I pick up there, yeah? Yes. Thank you. It's so full here. But there are some uh, seats on the other side. Even outside, you might go outside actually. All right, let me get my food without spilling it and then afterwards we're gonna connect and I show you how our food looks like. Seven two? Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. All right, challenge is not to spill this all over the restaurant before we get outside. There are seats outside actually, so we're gonna go there. Should be more quiet. Hello. How are you? Good. Nice to meet you. Oh, 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 my bills are flying around. All right, I think this is where we're gonna take a seat. My number was flying. All right. I already like this shopping mall. The way it's designed, basically you have the restaurants inside the shopping mall. You can enter from there or you can enter from here. Bye bye. See you. And then there's like KFC next door and we have the Jollibee. That's where we are uh, having lunch today. And then you can just come outside, sit if it's nice weather. And yeah, wow, look at this guys. This is our food which we have ordered from Jellyby. And uh, we are paying approximately 200. So it's not actually a big, uh, big amount. So 190. I need, I need to translate that number to see exactly how much we pay, but I think it's quite a reasonable number. So let's say 190 Filipino. That would be three dollars and thirty-eight cents. So around three dollars, you can have a full meal actually. Hi. <laughs> and this is how our food looks like, guys. Let's uh, rip off the bill here. This is the pie we got. The gentleman told me peach mango pie is the best, so I got it as a dessert. We have cola, they said cola goes great. And then they have a spaghetti, which is very different concept than all other fast food chains. 
especially KFC I think is the biggest competitor here and uh, they have cheese some tomato sauce here and then this might be actually a sausage uh, as well little pieces of sausage and of course the legendary chicken piece fried chicken so we're gonna try this out all together and then they also give us some sauce um, we will see what is it but this might be like a mushroom sauce but they also have kind of like a steak looking thing with a uh, rice i believe so you can get that you can get a burger if you like so lots of different options let me set you up on a tripod so you can see what i'm doing here right i think that should be quite good angle all right let's try this out and i'm gonna try to open the sauce first this is uh, how the sauce looks like i'm gonna should i like uh, go for a big bite or with my hand let's go for a big bite mm. super delicious not oily even though it's uh, fried but it's not oily and it's a um, good tenderness it's quite soft so you can actually I think dip into the sauce and then eat it like that super tasty I think in comparison with KFC KFC normally comes very oily but this one is not oily I think I don't I don't want to say it's uh, more healthy but uh, it's probably a little bit healthier because there's less oil on it super good we also have a spaghetti as well <coughs> I'm gonna take a piece with the cheese on top and as well as look at this there's steam comes out of it so it's quite hot and warm take some sausage and I'm gonna try take a big bite and test it all right let's go for it mm. very very tasty the cheese on the top gives a different flavor it has a little bit spiciness into it to the sauce it's a tomato sauce and uh, cheese on the top and sausage basically great option wonderful guys good option thanks to Jollibee thanks to Filipino people for letting me know this option I also seen on, on the lots of YouTube videos others as well um, encourage people go and try it out so great food option I will enjoy them my food and then later on I'm gonna show you how our pie tastes like and look like in a while all right we just finished our food and what's left behind is the dessert so this is the peach mango pie looks like a kids dessert but we're gonna try it out ah, it's a fried dough something like looking like the, from McDonald's the apple pie they have so I think inside gonna be warm so let's test this out mm. very similar to the apple pie from McDonald's but this one probably more tasty mm, very good peach and mango pie that was very delicious meanwhile you are sitting here you can enjoy the views to the city there's a little big park I think between the highway and then the kids are taking picture here probably this is a jalebi stand or something like that the parents and the kids 
The spice is so good, guys. Mm. Super delicious. Time to go slowly. I'm not sure how does it work here with the trolley thing. Should we put this there? I see that there are some workers. But we're gonna take our piece so we don't make too much work for them. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Very kind. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. So this was the Jalebi guys. They have an inside seating, there are so many cashiers because it's a popular chain here. You can also order from the screen here if you don't want to have a human interaction. Hello, see you guys, enjoy. <laughs> We are just out to where we have started our video. On the other side, you can see all the big brands too. There's a Zara, there's a Mango shop, and uh, Mango, not Mango, Mango. La Costa is there. So we might take a stairs or escalator to go upstairs to check out uh, how huge is this place. And there are lots of police in all the commercial places you go. All the banks and all the restaurants you enter. It's not just a normal security guys, but there's actually properly equipped police is in the door always. In the hotel rooms, restaurants. So even here, like inside the shopping mall, it's considered like safe place. But still every business, uh, especially the food chains, has a police dedicated to that restaurant. All right, this might be the way to go up. So let's check the, take the escalator to go upstairs. Check out what we have. From the first impressions, it looks great. It looks very organized. I think you can find all the major brands you are looking for here. I mean, it's the fifth biggest shopping mall in, in the entire world and the biggest one in Philippines, so I would doubt that you would have a hard time to find everything you need in Philippines. So this is the second floor and then there's actually another floor to the third one that would be the last floor. But let's take a little bit different turn to see what else we find here. I already see some area for the kids to play. Tom, Tommy Hilfiger. There's a Calvin Klein jeans here, some Sonnet. I actually might need to come here to buy some uh, bag because I have only uh, carry on luggage and I think I need it as a backpack to put my laptop and other stuff. I left home like that, but it doesn't fit my stuff anymore. So I need to extend my space a little bit. So yeah, this is the space where the kids can play, but uh, this is the upper part of the carousel, but down part is where are the kids are playing. Here we go. The kids are can sit in the second floor or first floor as you like, and that's the entrance basically. Beautiful, yeah. The rest of it is going to be basically shops. But uh, I'm gonna chill a little bit and then when I find more exciting things to do, to see, I'm gonna show you as the rest of this video. Just explored the second floor, now we are getting up to the third floor. It seems like there are more fun things to do there. The, the first floor were mostly shops. Hi, how are you guys? Hello, hello. So the first floor was mostly uh, restaurants, second floor shops, and third floor 
looks like a area to play this is called tiny town it's a place for kids to play there's a haircut place here called cuts for tots that's a funny name and then there's old moon studio self i don't know what is this probably making some pictures hi what is this place ah you make uh, pictures for instagram okay very nice how much you charge this is some order 200, this is some order 300. This is 200? Yes, 300. 300. Oh, Two hard okay. copies with soft copy and video time. Okay, very nice. Thank you. If I find friend, I come. <laughs> Thank you. See you. Yes, I make videos. Yes. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Bye bye. Thank you. Thank you. I just realized my camera doesn't like all the all the lights here. Some of them are actually like jumping but here is fine so this is a arcade games place you can play some games there it's very loud and then these are the claw machines you can play but I think you need to charge the cart and then you can just tap in here and try your chances it's quite a cool place I think so much fun things to do if you come here with your kids, it's amazing. There are so much more games on the other side. Beautiful corner. Oh, they are playing Tekken. Who is winning? You winning? I'm winning. Nice, well done. <laughs> okay, let's see who is winning. It's only 20 pesos. And now you can play. Good luck guys, bye bye. Thank you. Ah, such a cool place. I think if you come here with your kids, with your friends, with your family, you wouldn't be really bored. There are so many things, great things to do here. So this is the last floor basically, and then on top of it is the roof. So instead of uh, building the shopping mall, high they actually build it I think wider that's how it becomes the fifth biggest and this is another kids game with lots of balls and stuff like that oh one of the balls are running away hello hi how are you the adults can go in no <laughs> thank you bye bye and they have the cashier here you can purchase tickets this is a bank one of the biggest banks in in philippines bdo oh. teleporting it's a place for taking pictures i think and then they have a laser arena here so i think this is mostly laser games you can play we are not gonna go inside, but from outside you can already see how it looks like. Beautiful! Oh, I see more food places, so... I was actually not completely right. First floor and also the third floor, there's a food selection, food options. And these are completely different brands. I think first floor is mostly fast food and here you can get a more like a proper food. But still I believe it's a self-service. And then this is the the ice area, uh, ice place for skating. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm really bad at uh, skates, so we are not gonna embrace ourselves here. But there's a archery place. Maybe we can shoot some. That would be fun. Let's try. Hello, hi guys. How are you? How much is the archery? Five two five for one hour, three hundred twenty-five for fifty. Oh, one hour! It's five hour, not one shot. No, no, it's one thirty minutes. Yeah. Ah, okay. So thirty minutes at three hundred twenty-five, and one hour is five twenty-five. Beautiful. Thank you so much. See you. Bye bye. Thirty minutes is too much to keep shooting alone. That would have been fun. 
But if you are with someone, I think it's fun for certain minutes you can do. If I knew how to skate, I would actually go for this experience. They have the whole area where you can have fun. And this is the area where you change your shoes. At the same time, you can get some snacks if you like. Popcorn, hot dogs. This might mean there's also probably cinema here somewhere close by. I'm not sure. But amazing place, I really like it. I think it's such a fun place to arrive and spend almost whole day here and I think it wouldn't be even possible to finish and uh, experience everything you want to experience. Probably you need maybe two, three days to be everywhere and uh, have fun and enjoy the time here. So yeah, this was the basically food section and then the play area. And then uh, again, from here starts more shops. Uh, if you are in the mood for shopping, then you come and spend your whole day here. And this part is just continues to the other side. So I'm gonna go check out. If I see more fun stuff, guys, I'm gonna connect with you and show you the rest of the mall. But before, <clears throat> before I finalize this clip, I wanna say it's a normally not common thing that in the commercial places they let you film. And that's one of the coolest things here. Like they saw my camera, they saw I'm filming and no one actually ask or say anything what you are doing and what's your purpose. So everyone is very welcome, including the police and the security forces here. They allowed me to film and uh, show you the whole experience, which is really cool, makes me more comfortable so I don't have to hide the camera all the time, try to film. Uh, that's the one thing. And second thing, this place actually gets approximately 200,000 visitors every day. And I think during the evening, it's the fullest here. So during the evening, I think it gets more crazy busy here. And uh, you need to, uh, you need to probably come in the morning or afternoon during the working days for the best experience. If you are like me, don't like too much crowd. But uh, yeah, evenings gets really crazy here. Okay, we just, uh, meanwhile we are talking, we arrived to the another area where you can do the, this uh, crane games. And there is some, uh, another shop here. This is a jewelry place. And then more games. But there might be a lookup tower or the area where we can get outside and enjoy. So let's let's check that out. When you get to this game places, it's it's so crazy chaotic. There's an Aquaman. There's a game park. We're gonna go check that out too. So many different type of businesses, different food. Anything you are looking for is here, guys. Okay, I think from here we might be able to get out and... Oh, there's one more floor upstairs. But that's closed right now. That might be the rooftop already. Push, let's push. Woo, nice, how cool is that? People are just chilling here, enjoying their time. And uh, there is the Ferris wheel right there. If you make time, we might go later on. Go for a ride and enjoy some ride here in Philippines in Manila hello guys Hi. photo shooting yeah nice enjoy all right here we go right next to the beach guys as you can see the water is not too far away quite cool area but from here on it's industrial areas the fort and as you can see construction is going on and to the left side is the, where is the ferris wheel and i think there's more uh, amusement park style area i can see already some uh, games and adrenaline things here oh cool there's a there's a upstairs but uh, you cannot go all the way and then here is the little fountain an open area to chill and you can find some different cafes inside too. Beautiful, I love it. Cool concept, quite such a 
such a cool and fun place to be and spend your whole day here guys nice well done guys to Philippines and uh, whoever built this and invested all right gonna get inside and then we'll see you in a while hello there's an area called game park and here you can get bowling table tennis and as you can see people are playing right now how are you guys who, who is winning who, you and you winning what who is winning Oh, me and Okay, well done. You are good players? Where are you from? I'm from Azerbaijan. Do you know where is Azerbaijan? Yes? Nice. Not so many people know where is Azerbaijan. So, Nice. Where are you from? From Manila? Nice. Is it the after school or... Yes? Relaxing? Nice. Yes, I make YouTube videos. I travel around and share my experiences. Sorry? Going yeah, yeah, you will be there. Yes. Are you vlogging? Yes, I'm vlogging. Oh, YouTube, what, YouTube channel. what do you want to say to Philippine people? Um, uh, or you know or this, everyone in the world? Um, uh, keep spreading positivity. Well done, bro. <laughs> nice negativity. to meet you. Sorry? <laughs> but, <laughs> okay, I need to cut that part. <laughs> no, no, I'm gonna keep it. No, I, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. Don't worry. All right, guys, have fun. See you. Bye bye. So this is the billiard area. There's a, a basketball area. There's the archery, and then you can also do the uh, bowling on the other side. Nice. <laughs> Quite a cool area. So this is the advertisement for the Aquaman uh, for the movie, which is actually going on right now. I can tell you guys, not worth your money and energy. I have seen the Aquaman second one. I think first one was really cool, but the second one was horrible. You could guess everything gonna happen in the movie since beginning and uh, I mean, graphics and everything was great, but the storyline is horrible. And here we go. This is what they are advertising here, basically. I guess probably, hi. Probably a trailer is going on here, trying to get you to the cinema to watch it out. Hi, how are you? Have you, have you seen Aquaman? Do you like it? Second one? Okay, I don't like it. <laughs> it's a boring storyline, but but first one was good. Yes. Yes. Okay. Very nice. All right, guys. Have fun. See you. Bye. Hi, Welcome to my. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Let's. People are taking some pictures here too. Amazing. All right. Lots of uh, different cafes, restaurants. You can take and go, or you can just sit down and enjoy. Huge area. Like there are so much things to do, and I think we explored maybe only 20% of the shopping mall still and there are so much more to go so I will try to get to different parts more exciting things coming and I'm gonna show you uh, the rest of the mall of Asia the fifth biggest in the world and first biggest or the, the biggest in Philippines Right now we are outside the shopping mall. Actually, you leave the security on this side. As you can see, there are still shops downstairs and on the street too. So I think this is like two buildings. It connects, you get out from there, and then later on you enter from this side. And we're gonna enter to the wellness zone. So it's more like electronics place. And I wanna actually buy something here. So let's have a look. Hello, hi. Do I open this? Yes, it's okay. Thank you. So there's this uh, shop called Henry's Cameras and I'm gonna check out if they have a tripod that I'm looking for. The one I'm currently using, if they have the same tripod. Hello. Hi guys. Hello, how are you? Good? I would like to uh, ask if you have this tripod. Like GoPro tripod? No. This one, like that opens like from the under. No. Where, where I can find here? 
house. Camera house is the name of the shop. Yes. All right. Thank you. Thank you. So we're gonna find the camera house, and then from here starts cyber zone. Again, such a huge mall, guys. You can find any type of products you want. There's a clinic even here. There's a urban gadgets. You can get laptops or anything you're looking for. They said camera something. It should be somewhere here, probably. Some of these shops. Gadgets, games and gadgets, maybe here, maybe we ask. Hi guys, hello. Where I can find GoPro things like tripod and camera? Already. No, I, I asked them, they said no. They said uh, game. Camera house. Camera house, yes. Left side. Left. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you too. <laughs> it's uh, past already Christmas, but he was congratulating my Christmas. So, yeah. Camera house, that's the place we are looking for. But this place just continues further and further. You can find any type of uh, gaming equipment, laptop equipment. And uh, let's see. Oh my god, I, I almost crashed the lady. Hi, how are you guys? Camera house? Here, okay, thank you. People are super welcoming. As you can see, like you don't even have to ask, they just tell you where to go. Like they, they are like approaching first, they start the conversation even before I go to them and ask. Camera house is the one. Hello guys. Good afternoon, how are you? By any chance, do you have this tripod that opens up for GoPro? GoPro has this Or what type of uh, tripods you have? Uh, you have this one opening up one? Okay, but you don't have the big one like this? Uh, no. no, okay. Only that one. Uh, can I see the small one? How much is the small one? Uh, 2,400. 2,400, okay. So it's, it's good price, no? <laughs> yes. <laughs> can I please say, see it? See the box? There's a Hero Black 11. Or do you have different tripod for GoPro? Uh, only this one. Uh, this is shorty. Yeah, it's short. very short. Uh, table tripod. Yeah, this one I don't think I'm gonna like it. It's it has too many moving parts. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite, but it's very hard. Tripod for sale. Yes, can I see that? Oh, there in. Ah, in that shop. Yeah. Okay, I I go check it out. Thank you so much. This one was how much? 2,400. 2,400. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. See you. So this is a one option we have. And then there is a different tripods for, for phone. Maybe that might be interesting for us. But GoPro has a specific entrance. Hello. We have also this one, but it's not really for camera. Ah, you have this one too. Uh, how much is this? This one is 795. 790. Can I see that? Yes. So it's a little bit cheaper than the other one. Oh, it's quite heavy. So it just opens up like this? Yes, sir. It doesn't stay like this? No, sir. Okay. So it has to open all, all the way like this. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Do you know any other shop I can find GoPro products? GoPro products. Uh, try at Henry's store. Okay, okay, I will check it. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Yeah, but that's uh, that's too long and too big. They yeah. also have the uh, mini tripod. Yeah, yeah, but that's same as uh, the same, GoPro. Yes, yes, more yes. Cheaper. Yeah, I'm more cheaper. Yes. <laughs> but uh, I will check maybe other shops. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. So this is the gaming shop where you can buy gaming equipment and um, like the seating and the setup, everything you need. Hi sir! Hello, how are you guys? Uh, we're fine sir! You're good? 
I, sir. Good I, sir. I'm great. I, I when I see nice people like you, I'm more happy mm -hmm. here. Yeah, we're happy to see you here. Thank in you, the thank you, sir. Philippines is amazing, but people are even better. So yeah. thank you so much. Thank have you, a sir. good day have and have a, nice a beautiful sir. day. Yes, thank you. You too. Bye bye. Thank you. So guys, we just arrived to the electronics shop, but I didn't find really what I need because GoPro tripods are very very specific, so it will be hard to get one. But anyway, I'm just gonna explore to see what else we find and I might connect with you in a while. This is the ground floor and there is more sport magazines here. Adidas, Nike, they're even selling some cars. There's a Decathlon upstairs and a uh, few other restaurants here and my goal is to find some dessert and i know that philippines people love uh, halo halo this is the dessert that looks like this halo halo so i heard that i can find it somewhere here hi i think here in Chowking. you can get some Popcorns, I think, here, some other sweets. There's a fila shop here. Yeah, like the, it's an endless shops here. You can find anything you're looking for. So, it's time to get some dessert. It starts from 59. Chow King, hello. Oh, here we go. We have the advertisement, as you can see. It's uh, some type of dessert, but has like so many things on it. So that's what we're gonna have. But this place is more like fast food place. Let's see what type of uh, quality we're gonna get with Hello Hello. Hi. Someone dropped a coin. How are you guys? I can have a Hello Hello. It's a basic or what's the price? 90 sir for regular. Okay. 110 for special. 90 for regular. Regular. Halo, halo. Okay. And 110? Special. Special. Okay, yes. I want special. Yes, 110 please. Thank you. How many are there, sir? Uh, that's it. Only this. Only one. Only one, yes. I'm gonna pay. There's a 200 here. Thank you so much. Hello, hello, special for Dabut. So, this is what we have inside all type of fruits and. This is ice cream? Yes, sir. Okay. It's the purple yum? Purple yum. This is the purple yum ice cream and then all types of other stuff. And the base of it is a, I, is a milk or at the bottom is milk? Yes, both. Milk. Milk and ice cream. Milk, ice cream, ice, mix, everything. Okay. Hi. Hi, sir. How are you? I'm good. I am trying. Are you? you are the manager? Yes, sir. I'm trying your Hello Hello. Your is, change code. Oh, is, is the best? Yes, sir. Okay. I tried. My first time. Thank oh, you, we got, sir. We got so many change. I can leave you some tip. Tips okay? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I sit outside. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We got our hello hello request, which gonna come soon. Let's uh, have a seat here somewhere. Oh, there's some loud music. Music is the enemy of all the YouTubers because copyright strikes, and then you cannot post any of those videos. But yeah, they give you a number like this. It says 16 Philippines, there's United States, United Arab Emirates, blah, 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 blah. Chow King, that's the brand. Meanwhile, I couldn't find the tripod, but I went for a little bit shopping because I'm coming from winter. So I needed some uh, winter, uh, summer things. So I got myself a short and a uh, new black shirt. So that's what's happening. I got something from Zara. And now, just now waiting for Hello Hello. 
to try it out and have our suites, finalize our visit here in the shopping mall. And uh, it was a great experience, but let's wait for Halo Halo to see how we are ending the trip here in this biggest mall in Philippines. Thank you so much. It's so huge. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, we have the Halu Halu here. That looks massive. There is no chance that I'm gonna finish this. But it's actually quite light. So, this is the most favorite dessert of Filipino people. And uh, we are paying approximately two American dollars. The price of it was 110 uh, Filipino pesos. And that comes to almost two dollars. Quite a great deal for such a massive dessert we are getting. So this is a purple yum. Uh, that's the flavor, purple yum. And they, the Filipino people love purple yum and they put it almost to anything, to cakes and to ice cream. And of course we can see it in the Halo Halo too. Yeah, so I'm not sure how we're gonna start eating this. I have a very big doubt that this bowl is gonna drop somewhere. So maybe let's let's put this like here. If it drops, it's not on the floor. But let's try. This is gonna be my first time trying purple yum ice cream. Let's give a shot. Hmm, it's tasty. I don't know what I was expecting, but it's very tasty. Very nice. I think what I'm gonna do is gonna take this balls and then try to get inside the base to see what's here. I can see some jelly, some beans, and the bottom of it is I don't know what is this. It's, she said milk at the bottom, but it looks like rice to me. Mmm, it's ice. Basically, ice with milk, and um, we have a jelly here. We have a beans. That's what's happening, guys. All right, let's give it a and as a shot. It's very, very icy and cold for my taste. I think I'm not gonna eat the bottom part because it's only milk and ice, but the top part is quite tasty actually. So I guess you need to mix it all with the bottom and everything, but I'm gonna eat what's at the top. The jellies and we have a dried banana, I think. We have ice cream, beans, and everything else you can see, guys. It's so tasty. Very good. For two dollars you can share this dessert with two, three people easily. It's so massive. I don't know why I went for the special, but I think the medium one would just come small portion. But it's great. So, this is how our Filipino dessert looking like, guys. It tastes great. And I'm gonna try to finish the top part. Not gonna touch the bottom because mostly ice there. All right. I'm gonna see you later guys, thank you so much for watching until this moment and we'll see you in a bit. We just arrived at a different part of the mall and looks like mall inside the mall. It's a super big market. You can find all the clothes and makeup and it's actually also multiple floors. As you can see it's uh, first floor, second and then third looks like some place for the kids and I actually purchased this backpack because I really needed something extra to carry my stuff one luggage is not really enough but yeah there's so many sales ladies here uh, different cashiers like cashier number 14 imagine there are 14 different cashiers here which is crazy and then this is the ladies area and uh, we're gonna leave slowly because longer longer I stay here I spend more money so 
it's time to leave. The prices are premium, of course, uh, but there is a choice for anyone. So whatever is your budget, you can always find uh, good quality stuff for a good price and for your budget. And uh, but it, there is premium prices, but also good quality things. Right now we're gonna leave from here. As you can see, this is where is the main part of the mall. You can see main mall and entertain mall is on the left and then South Transport Terminal is to the right side. So that's where I'm gonna head slowly. But yeah, there, there's a down floor that I haven't been fully yet. And uh, there's a Moa Square. Ikea is there, that's crazy. I didn't know Ikea is here too. There's also Moa Arena. It's crazy, so many things are here. So it is really massive. As I said, I think you need two, three days fully explore this area. But uh, it's been a quite a cool experience. Now I am heading back to the hotel to take some rest. And then I will see you in the next video, guys. Thank you so much for watching and see you in a while. Oh, look at this. This is some arena, I think, connected to the mall as well. So this is the mall and then there's the Ikea behind it. And then the another side is the arena. Impressive. And this is the all the bus stations. Probably takes you to different parts of uh, Manila. Crazy, crazy. And this is where we started our journey. Ah, we can see the full name of the Mall of Asia. And the rain is coming in a distance. The taxi dropped me there. That was the main entrance. We explored as much as we could, but we didn't go fully to the other side. There's a IKEA as well. Yeah, quite massive area. All right, guys, see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.